Hey everybody, it's Ken with the Mad Dog Gaming here to got a little uh, tutorial here on how to remove that annoying Windows 7 is not genuine file. Uh, or pop-up, excuse me. So you get a pop-up right here whenever you turn on your computer. It's kind of annoying if you didn't buy the, <laughs> the actual version of Windows, which I did not. Um, so you'll have Windows 7 uh, is not uh, genuine. You'll always have that, all right? That's not going to be removable unless you get a CD key. And I can show you how to get a CD key really cheap. So without further ado, click on the Start menu, go to Control, uh, I'm sorry, Computer. Then you're going to go to your C drive. And you're going to go to Windows. Now, we need Windows uh, System 32. That's used to make a lot of changes in Windows. So just keep that in mind. And we go to System 32. Now, you're looking for a file called SLUI. It's an executable file called SLUI. It's easier just to search for it, S-L-U-I, right up here in the search. Now, I have renamed this SLUI fake because I've already removed mine. But I wanted to show you this for this video. So anyway, it's going to say SLUI executable. Uh, you're going to right click on this. You want to take ownership of this. You cannot delete this in its present form. All right. So you have to take ownership. So click properties. Now you're going to go to security. Then advanced. And then owner. Now this is where you take ownership of the actual file. So you're going to select your username here and then click edit and now select your username right here and now you can take ownership of this file you're going to click apply and then OK OK again and now you own the file now you still can't delete this file alright you need to give yourself full access to it so in order to do that right click go to properties Security again, system, edit, and now in the edit you're going to select your username. And as you can see, I've already given myself full control. So you're going to click on allow right here for full control. Then you're going to click apply, OK, OK again. And now you can safely delete the file. Uh, like I said, this is not going to remove the annoying Windows 7 is not genuine down here, but it will remove that annoying pop-up. Tune in later for another uh, video on how to get that CD key and how to uh, implement that CD key. It's really cheap, 31 bucks uh, to do it. Uh, anyway, thanks for tuning in to the Mad Dog Gaming. Have a great day.